<laughs> oh. Oh shit, this is a Team Star thing. I didn't realize. Oh, hey, Prof. <laughs> Sorry, hey, Clive. Oh, I see you, Biddy. Director Clavel? Like I said before, the name's Clive. Please don't forget it. Anyway, Biddy, I owe you one. And thanks to you, I've been accepted into Operation Starfall. I need answers. That's all. How do I resolve the situation with Team Star? And what's causing its members' odd behavior? Odd behavior? Team Star is the subject of a more than a few nasty rumors from our swirling around the academy, you know. Some say their bullying has caused a worrying number of students to drop out of school. Others say they're holed up in their bases, planning to cause trouble for the academy. But these are rumors that the matter I'm directly confronted with is something else. I'm talking about Team Star's persistent truancy. They've been all skipping classes for a while now. The five of them in particular, the so-called bosses of Team Star, haven't so much as set foot inside a classroom for over a year. And it seems the team's ranks and file have recently stirred up mischief as well. That's why I took it upon myself to issue a direct order to Team Star to disband. I informed them that if they would should re should they refuse, I would have no choice but ex to expel all students affiliated with their team. But I'm afraid there's been no response, and the deadline I set for them to make their choice between dissolution or expulsion is nigh upon us. So you see, when I overheard you talking on the phone to Cassiopeia. I couldn't... It couldn't have come at a more crucial time. Speaking of... It's Cassiopeia. Can you hear me? <laughs> Another time. Be careful. I see you're coming up to one of the Team Star's bases. Was there someone with you just now? Nope. Well, be warned that Team Star will have its guard up after losing one boss to you already. The base won't go down as easy as the last one. Proceed with extreme caution, and I'll be in touch. You know, I wasn't planning on going there. I'll be back. Because <laughs> I don't even know what kind of base it is. I will be back. I was looking at Pokemon. <laughs> Hello! I heard you mark out. I'm honestly kind of excited to see more of the ice Pokemon we can get. They're, they are in the top five favorites for sure. Hello, I'm here to fight you. I am that bitty kid. Maybe I am. Why does she get to wear heels? Like, they look so cool. Why can't we have their outfits? Minus the helmet. Sassy kids, like you are the worst. Yeah, I am sassy. What do you want? I will say, though, I really like the Team Star music. <laughs> Almost one-shot it. Let's go! Next! <laughs> I'm not sure what songs like Toby Fox did, but I know he could post. Really? Did he? That's cool. I did not know that, actually. That was really cool, though. Hey, we got some prize money, too. I should really start battling trainers along the road now I think about it. 
for money and stuff. Where is your problem now? Fish here for me, would you, bud? Hey, thanks. Hasta la vista. Okay, goodbye. Hasta la vista. <laughs> She's new to the team, you know. Might have to have a little chat with her about that attitude. <sighs> well, I'm gonna go on the base and get the rest of the squad a, a heads up. We'll come at you full force if you set foot inside. So you might want to consider turning tail. Either way, best of luck to you, amiga. Okay, goodbye. I see you took care of the guards. Nice work. Now, hold up in that base is Team Star's Dark Crew, the Seguin Squad. Their boss is Giacomo. Pretty much runs the whole... Runs the whole Team Star. And he also produced that wild soundtrack of theirs himself. He's a sharp guy. Even our declaration of war won't, wouldn't have, won't ruffle, have reveled him in the slightest. His plan is probably to wear you down with a wave of grunts, and then finish you off himself. No use trying to outthink strategic types like him. Bring him down with a head-on attack. Keep on defeating as many Pokemon as you can until the big man shows himself. Ring the bell on the gate once you're ready, and kick off this phase of the operation. Time to wipe the Seguin Squad off the map. You got it, Miss Ma'am. Yep. Let's go. Hi, Clive. Some kid lucked up beating one of our sister squads. And now she can think she can take us on. Time to give her the boot, gang. Let's show this gate crasher what Team Star can do. And if you're listening, gate crasher, know this. Unless you can beat 30 of our Pokemon in 10 minutes, our boss won't lift a finger to deal with the likes of you. <laughs> I feel like they did bounce. Maybe it's because they took away her boots. Go on, Pad. Oh, he's so cute! I gotta remember to send a photo of Pod's new evolution to him later on uh, Discord. They took her what? Her boots! So, Cassiopeia in League of Legends, she's a snake. You didn't know. Um, but before, she used to be able to buy boots. And people are like, but she's a snake! Why does she need boots? And so... They took away her ability to buy boots and just gave her more movement speed. One boot on the tail, yes. Fun little... fun little tidbit. I don't know how Nami wears boots, she's a fucking fish! Yes, yeah, is my baby. She is so good. I love her. Mm. Go, Puddling, go! You're doing great, babies! I'm gonna defeat four more. Is this the last four or did I miss one somewhere? Oh no, there's more over here. Eee, there we go! We did it! Jazz, Kale, and Eve, yes! She's way above our level. We gotta get to get the boss. Fucking fight me.
Done a real number on us, Party Crasher Biddy, was it? I am Gia Como. At the desk, I go by DJ Vice. Call me whichever. It's a vibe either way. Nice to meet you and all, but how about we skip straight to your outro? Don't worry, I'll play you a sick requiem as you crash and burn. Let's get this party started. You better have good music. I wasn't gonna be disappointed. Here's a party. Is there cake or pie? I don't think so, sadly. Alright, let's do this. You really don't think things think things through, do ya? Declare war on Team Star and whatnot. Well, I did anyways. Hi! Thank you so much for the raid, sweetie. How was your stream? Can we please get some shoutouts from my wonderful friend Kai? It's good to see you. You're just coming in. We're currently fighting the Dark Pokemon Team Star base. How was the stream? How was Elden Ring? See you guys and gals and every person I know. Kai, go love him. He's wonderful. Good friend of mine and more. Time to up this tempo. The show ain't over yet. Hi, Kai. It's good to see you. Alright, am I fighting the car now? Okay, we're fighting the car. Chat, we've officially started fighting the vehicle. It's time to bedazzle this bitch. I am hungry, but I shouldn't eat. I guess I... I can have an insure. But say, do you have like any like uh, insures or water or something? So I know it's late night, obviously. You probably don't want to eat super late. Welcome in, everyone. I hope you all enjoy your stay into the Pokemans. It's been a nice and chill time. Stream was good. How was Pokemon? I saw you post about sorting your boxes. I feel that. <laughs> Listen. You sometimes just gotta- you just gotta take a second to organize. I love being organized on these games. It drives me nuts when I struggle to find, like, certain types of Pokemon. <laughs> but it's been good! We, um, we have- we're- we got our fourth gym badge now. We just defeated the water gym Pokemon with, like, the most worst setup ever because I thought it was a normal gym. It was very much the water gym. The whole aesthetic was water, and my brain just did not put two and two together until the last second because I'm great at that. <laughs> but it's been a really good time. I'm really, really, really enjoying it. And I'm glad stream was good. Thank you again. I guess it's like a vehicle they made that I guess like maybe it has like the engine Pokemon in it. I'm not entirely sure. Get yucked. I didn't even need any other Pokemon. I just needed the fucking duck. Get yucked. <gasps> what? It crashed! It hasn't even been six hours! Oh. Do I gotta do it again? I mean, it's fine. <sighs> I'm sorry, I'm yelling. Forgive me. Okay, so do we gotta fight him again? It looks like it. Maybe? Yes? Okay, well, let me... Let me do a thing. Okay. 
We go again. All right. Well then, round two. Let your boogaloo. I'll just equally eat your bet. Eat. Beat your ass. <laughs> Anyways. God damn it. What if that's the first crash we've actually had? B. Oh my goodness. Thank you for the raid, beautiful. How was your stream? We also get a shout out for eyes on B. Welcome in, everyone. We just had our game crash, so I gotta redo this whole part. So, welcome in. We are currently fighting the Dark Star crew. How was your stream? It's good to see you. Welcome, welcome in, everyone. We can get all the shoutouts of her mods. I'd appreciate it. What were you playing today? Welcome in. Yes, the Quexly su Supremacy. We love the Ducky Boy. <laughs> You're playing this too? Nice! What were you, uh... What were you up to? And may I ask what starter and such you chose? I'd love to hear about what you've been up to. Welcome in, everyone. Hey, guys and gals and every post, you know, eyes on B. B is wonderful. She's a sweetheart and more. Please go love her. She is great. And hopefully, the game will not crash again. If it does, I will be so sad, but... Fingers crossed, everything's okay. <laughs> Quaxly 2, let's go! Quaxly evolved to be... Be careful who you make fun of in and out of high school. True, Quaxly is fabulous, okay? They are fierce and fab. <laughs> I'm trying, man. Yeah, that's the first crash we've experienced. I don't know if any of y'all who've also been playing this have been experiencing any bugs or issues, but... If you have, I hope they have been minor and not too inconvenient. But thank you again for bringing over your community. Welcome in, everyone. And again, thank you, Kai, as well, for bringing over your community as well. I really appreciate you all, and I hope you enjoy your stay here. It is a pleasure to have you all here. That's a little about me and a little about our community. If you'd like to read it, I do hope y'all enjoy your stay. And now we get to kick this guy's ass again with one Pokemon because Quaxly is a strong and independent duck. <laughs> oh, I appreciate you too, Kai. All right. We go again. Hopefully this time with less crashing. Because this long load screen scaring me right now. Alright, I'm gonna skip through this dialogue because we've already seen it. Did you really eat us? Let's go. That is a big car. Let's talk about that car. Alright, please do not Crash. Again. Alright. Chat, if you have any bless emotes, please put them in the chat. All the blesses that this will not crash again. Please do not crash. I would very much like to defeat this Team Star person, please. Oh. Goodbye! Fucking ya yeet! I probably didn't need to use that ability so early, but we'll still win. We have a whole team just for this. Alright, Max. Let's kick some ass. Alright, please do not crash. We believe... ...in the non-crashing supremacy. Please. Oh god, I'm nervous. 
please don't crash. 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 One more hit. Oh, one more hit. Did you use your Azumarill? Azumarill is just so good. I actually, I've been playing the Scarlet version offline. And um, I actually got a shiny uh, Meryl. It's so cute. I did not know as a Meryl's shiny color would be so gorgeous, but I need it. It's so pretty. And they're such a good Pokemon. All right, please do not crash. Please. Please. Please, no. I guess that's that. Please don't crash. About a year and a half ago. Yes, that's that. What's up, Giacomo? Did something happen? The big boss is why my take on some stuff. So we had chat and settled on a few plans. A few plans. Like what? Operation Star, first of all. And also, a new code of conduct for the team. You know how tons of new members have joined up recently. Well, we figured out some of them how to... Sorry, we figured we gotta make some team rules like a code so we're all on the same page. Nice. You'll come up with a great code for us, right? Won't you, Giacomo? Ah, no thanks. Way too much pressure. I mean, yeah. I used to be the president of the student council, but you know everyone ended up hating me after that, right? Of course you know. You forced a ton of stuffy rules on everyone, and they wouldn't take it. And we got the, some other nerd to replace you after like five minutes. I cannot help but concur. Male students' hair must stray no further than 1.8 inches below the nape and so forth. Your rules are vex a vexation made manifest. My point exactly. Do you all agree that I shouldn't be let anywhere near this new code? But you always know what's best for the team, Giacomo. You look out for us. You've earned our trust many times over without you. Team Star just wouldn't work. And that stuck-up student council press isn't who you are anymore, man. A code written by Giacomo? I'm looking at her now, I'd follow that any day. As would I. Okay, okay. Thanks for the ego boost, everyone. I'll do it. I'll write up the darn code. <laughs> yeah, it's like a it's like a greenish, like almost like a seafoam green. It's so pretty. I did the best I could. I wrote that code myself. There's no going back on it. My days as a boss are over. But here, take my badge, would ya? Aww. <laughs> I like his backpack. I like the straps. I'll give you this TM too. You earned it fair and square. Thanks. So this is how the party ends. Let's talk about those Pokemon of yours. They're crazy strong, huh? You learned those trader chops at the academy? Like what moves you should use and stuff? Hmm, okay. You like at the academy. Having fun? I'm enjoying it. No kidding. Sorry to interrupt, but are you Giacomo? Whoa! Wasn't expecting a giant pompadour to make a guest appearance today. <laughs> you got a Quaxel to get that style up for you? I'm going for it. I'm just after a quick road. I'm just after a quick road, would you mind? Sure. I tell you something annoying, but I guess my I'm newly freed up for time. Thanks. I'll get straight to it. It seems all of you and Team Star are headed for expulsion if you keep up your current activities. So why won't you break up the team and start attending classes at the academy again? That's what you want to know? As it happens, we're actually waiting on a pal. But we don't know if they'll be coming back. A pal? A close friend of yours, are they? 
they're the strongest boss in all of Team Star. Like, they're a top champion who's ab the absolute number one trainer, you know. They're the one who invited us other bosses to form the team, and we call them Big Boss. And where's this Big Boss of yours now? What we like to know. We haven't heard from him, I don't know, must be a year and a half now. We thought that we kept Team Start going, then they get back in touch one day. But the teachers keep pressuring us to call it quits. And then we have party crashes like you two. Maybe this big boss did ditch us. They were all talking about breaking up the team before and all. So Team Star and this big boss of yours, is it really that important to you? <laughs> is the sky blue? Let's put it to two words you eggheads at the academy might understand. They're my greatest treasure. <laughs> it is a large pompadour, it's true. Biddy, it's me. I take it that Giacomo Star Badge is now in your possession? Yes, ma'am. I see. With its boss out of the picture, the Seaguin Squad is pretty much done for. Mm, Giacomo. Sorry, I got distracted for a second there again. Now about your reward. I'll transfer for some LP over to your phone as promised. Let's go! Use those new GMs to strengthen your Pokemon even further. I'll have my supply unit rep meet you shortly to deliver some bonus materials too. Oh, you're fine, Yetus. I do like the that the forts are kind of like like the raids are like playing in backyard forks. Forks? Forts. <laughs> Sorry for the ads. Um, I currently have the ad ad manager going on because I'm doing the ad incentive program. But, I do appreciate you sticking around regardless. Thank you. Penny is adorable. I love her. She is so cute. Hey, it's me again from the supply unit. Ah. Ugh, what the heck? I just want to say hello. Hey, stop that! <laughs> hey, somebody help! Oh my gosh. The baby just wants to give you love, I'm sorry. Ugh, it drooled all over me. What even is that Pokemon anyway? It's really awesome. There. I guess what's the word for it? Is it really that special? And uh, before I forget, here's your reward. Thank you. Um, your name's Biddy, right? Since you're part of Operation Starfall's battle unit, can I ask you something? What do you think of Team Star? Uh, really not all that. Interesting. You know, some of the rumors say Team Star wasn't always a bunch of delinquents. Most of them used to be victims of bullying, or they just found it hard to interact with people. But then these misfits and outsiders found each other and banded together to form Team Star. All they wanted to do was push back against the bullies they couldn't face alone. But, uh, that's just info I got from my hacking other students' social media accounts. I also found some talk about the secret mastermind behind the five bosses. Someone who recruited them to choose the team in the first place. I don't normally talk this much. Now my throat kind of hurts. Smacked my wrist into uh, my desk. Whoops. 
All right, let's save in case anything crashes. God forbid. <laughs> 